All right, we got this beautiful something's burning. I love I know, something's I love burning. I love Jeremiah stuff For so much. <laughs> Jeremiah Wonders is so good, He's and I an like to examine character. these people because Jeremiah Wonders holds a lot of hostility, a lot of hate, uh, a lot of resentment. He comes off. He's trying to be this nice, lovable goof, but there's a lot of problems. So something's burning. This is Burt Kreischer's show. They had the whole Kill Tony crew on. That means Tony Hinchcliffe. Brian, Brian Redman, Jeremiah Watkins, Joel, Joel Jolberg, Joel Mendez, and Chris. Chroma Chris. <laughs> I know these wow, guys. Wow, Jules, like, you're I good. I know my own family. Where do I find these sons of bitches? Uh, it's a, oh, sorry, you don't have your glasses on. Hold on. Yeah, I can't see a thing. You gotta get, it's right above the Compound Media Christmas party. Compound, <laughs> and that's the hardest one to find, Compound Christmas. Okay, it's one, two, oh, three, Jeremiah, four, five, six from the bottom. Eggs, okay, something's burning. Let's start from the beginning. Let's show Side you. my eye what this looked like. Something's burning, Bert Kreischer. We love this show. We Usually get when I get really frustrated and I say to myself, you're 46, Bert, when I bite my tongue. Here it comes. Whenever I bite my tongue eating, I'm like, you should be past this by now. I've had this tongue in my mouth for 40. Hey, Jeremiah, you want to join the fucking show? Yeah. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Wow. Sure, yeah, bring the band. There's something with Jeremiah, you know, behind the scenes, everybody's always at it with him, right? Everybody's kind of, he must oh, be. Jeremiah, want to join the show? He must be very autistic and, um, what is that word, uh, like snarky. And they must all kind of, nah, fuck. Because you're going to see a lot of Jeremiah's shade here. Jeremiah wonders, Jeremiah Watkins, Jeremiah says so. Remember him? So look at this scene here in the Something's Burning Kitchen. You got Tony Hinchcliffe, of course, the leader. He's in control. His buddy Red Band, who's basically VP. Then Joel, the idiot, Amendez, the loser, the drummer. Remember all these people. Let's see what happens here. They're already yelling at Jeremiah, so this is a good start. Jeremiah, you want to join the fucking show? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> Jesus He's got Christ. his saxophone. Wow. Sure, bring the band. Where <laughs> <laughs> do you wrong. see how loud this is when they play any fucking song? So they've got the whole band in there. They're on set, and they're all complaining that it's too loud, so they're making the band play at half volume. It's like, guys, let it be loud. It's a show. Let the band be loud. They're all rolling their eyes at the band. By the way, the band makes Kill Tony. It's part of the big show. It's pretty much the best part. Tony Let's... thinks everyone's tuning in just because of him. Actually, Tony's the most replaceable part of the show, if you think about it. I'd say. Anyone could do the Tony role. I, I said, I said, I, I said, because I know that this is a full experience. You can't do Kill Tony without having everyone there. And I was like, everyone this. needs to be here for it. But man, I regret that. Like, so <laughs> much. We could have had them on Skype or something. You know? <laughs> Go ahead, just give them a little hint of what it sounds like when you guys yeah. play. Look, they're embarrassed yeah. to play. <laughs> Look at Red Band. Ooh, and Red Band's even... See, Red Band and Tony are kind of... Red Band's trying to impress Tony, and he mocks the band now, too, which I don't like. Red Band, these are your guys. Tony's not your guy. He'll I leave know, you in the dust. These are your guys, the nerds. So I don't like watching Red Band get all royalty on these guys and start turning on them. Look at this face he's making. Afraid do you, to play. Do you guys only play breakup songs? Or do you play? <laughs> I will understand. Now, Red Band appears to be wearing a micro suede burnout v neck <laughs> covered in sweat. This is awful. He is wearing a long sleeve, which I appreciate. Cover up those D's. But he's got a burnout V underneath, which, which means a very thin, heathered v neck. It is sweaty. You could see all the mold. You could see all the. Uh, mounds and stuff like that. Not a good look. And he's sitting on a stool. He looks like a big, fat Jewish teacher. And... I think that's a suicide song. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah, step back from that ledge. <laughs> oh, oh, that's right. Step back from the ledge, my friend. Still a breakup song. Depends on the relationship. Yep, yeah, Tony the so. leader. Yeah. <laughs> so, so suicide and break. Wait, Tony you've been playing that all night. What other songs you guys What's got? What's that? Tony only shops at Express for men. He does. He shops at Structure, and he only uses gift cards for clothes. Clothes don't come out of his money. Okay. <laughs> So like, suicide and break Wait, you've been songs. playing that all night. What other songs you guys got in your in your quiver? 
Is yeah. that the only one? Another one? Oh, well, like, yeah. We got one other one. We got one <laughs> other one. One other one. Do you want to save it? Now there's Sean. <laughs> I, mean, I don't want to blow your load within the first two minutes I of the mean, show. Okay. I mean, I mean no, let's bring the heat. Let's bring the fucking heat. Okay. People are here for one thing. Yeah. One, All right. two, one, two. <laughs> Then they all die laughing over this ironic 80s tune, okay? I don't think that's funny to make fun of music, you know? You I don't? Re- no, not at all. I don't mock music. Music is to be respected. Or you mean old music? I don't think it's funny to make fun of music for being Any corny. Any music? Any music. Music is nice, okay? Wow. Let's, this is new. Yeah, well, uh, it's new, it's old. Who knows? <laughs> uh, let's cut to 2525. Bert is mad that the show hasn't been picked this up. This is Which just show? a short, tiny one. This is a short one. Very I didn't short. even see this. Twenty-five, twenty-five. Now, what show are we talking about here? That he's Something's mad. Something's burning. Oh, he's mad that so it hasn't been picked up. So this is a look into up. why the comedians make all of these shows because oh they're hoping my to God, be wait. picked up. They're creating these shows as if they're startups, mm-hmm. Silicon Valley startups. Mm-hmm. So these guys are all making these shows. And then pitching them to real networks. Mm-hmm. We saw Andrew Schultz did this. You know, Andrew Schultz, these guys are trying to build this career. Oh, I'm a YouTube guy. I'm like one of you. I'm a man of the people. So what they're really doing is they're building these shows. They build an audience and then they pitch it to networks to try to get these shows bought and sold and picked up because they don't want to be on YouTube. They don't want to be doing this. They want to be on TV so they could exactly. impress their grandmother and their mom. Okay, this is sick. Let's hear what he says. So you don't actually reach down, what? but you like fan it just to see if it comes up. Oh, yes. no, I mean, no, 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 no. I, yeah. I will go. He's I'm not home. joking. Yeah. I will go into I'm not saying, my asshole. I'm saying a quick. And like, if, it's, if it's real squeaky, yeah. and bring it right to uh, the face. Yeah. Sometimes so. when it smells like armpits, you're like, oh, I gotta go. I, I gotta Dude, take a shower. Right I now. love bad smells on myself. I yeah. love a bad okay. smell. I yeah. like a fart. Well, I can't wait for this chicken. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing good. We're How long do we have to boil the potatoes? I for? don't know. I, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not the best cook. Hence the reason no one's picked up this fucking show. Oh, I don't know how. I, I love this show. I watch it all the time. It's great. It's turned into a much better show than I ever. What happened to my. Oh. That's, oh. that's your potato bowl, right? And they think that like networks are sitting there going, oh, what are the comedians up? They're not doing that. You have to, you know. They really think if you build it, they will come and they're going to get the call. The call. We would like to put you on with Johnny Carson. Is that it, Jules? That part? That was it, yeah. Okay, Just a Just, that's a short insight. one. So, um, Jeremiah, they're all cooking, and the show is usually Bert is the main cook and everyone sits around. But this time, Jeremiah starts bragging that he makes the best eggs. I love this bit. So, Jeremiah is bragging. Oh, I make the best eggs eggs i make the best eggs no one can beat my eggs so they challenge him and you can see the rest of this till kill tony group kind of i don't really have too much respect for jeremiah they'll kind of roll their eyes at this oh yeah he makes the best eggs so jeremiah must be a braggadocious little know-it-all guy with a bunch of stuff and it doesn't really come true so it falls flat let's see this Want to watch Jeremiah make some eggs? Let's see how it goes. What do we got? 30, 15? Let's see what happens here. This is interesting. You're going to like this one. That's all you're talking about. Right. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. That's light. Close. I think these Sit are back and relax. Not done, done yet. Wow. That's fucking not. Yeah, do you put no, some salt not, in the water? Not. You put some salt in the water? I did it makes not it, put salt in the water. You know, that makes it boil faster and get hotter. I did Bert. not put salt in it. I heard you're good at making eggs. Is that true? Who told you that? I just That's just a word on the street because I make pretty good eggs. So I oh. Just make- oh, what do we got here? So Jeremiah is sitting there, and this is how tricky Jeremiah <laughs> could be. See, Jeremiah has got some stuff going on. He goes, I hear you're pretty good at making eggs. But he only said that so that he could follow up immediately with, you know, and I'm pretty good at making eggs. Jeremiah has always been one. He wants to show off his skills. He loves singing, he loves performing, more so because he wants people to see what he could do. He loves improv forcing people into his Yes, but he really likes showing off. It's like a humble brag thing going on with him, 
What do you mean you heard, heard Bert was good at making eggs? You just want to make eggs. Watch this. Making eggs, is that true? Who told you that? I just, that's just a word on the street because I make pretty good eggs. So I just I was kind of fucking, scoping you out, dude. I make great eggs. I make the best scrambled eggs you've ever had in your Actually, entire life. Actually, I'm going to interrupt you right there just because I find this to be an anomaly. I can't wait. My friend Jeremiah here actually truly makes the best scrambled eggs right. in the world. Oh, Which money we wow. Doing here this we right go. Now. Bert pulls out some fucking eggs. Let's see. Can Jeremiah kill these eggs? I can't wait to find out. Now, I know how to make eggs. You know I can make eggs. The best. I can do all that stuff, okay? Can Jeremiah do you it? So I need to bring it up. Of course. You I know what eggs. I'm watching here. And you know what you're watching. We all know how to make Gordon Ramsay's eggs and all the eggs. Let's see what happens here. Oh. We're doing it right fucking okay, now. Okay, just... I'm, I'm warning you. He's really good at this, Bert. I will be the judge of that. Maybe we can By do By the it. way, do you remember the eggs I made? Cut. Flashback. You egg. I made eggs with Big J, and I and I stole off of some guy's recipe. Some guy on fucking some British guy. What's his name? Right. Gordon. I've never heard of Gordon Ramsay. Okay. But, Shut it down. Yeah, but I make great fucking eggs. Now I'd like to try your eggs. And I was like sample them. And yeah, I really dude. Can we just okay. say Ladies and gentlemen, Jeremiah Watkins. Yeah. yeah. Now are we? Thank you. Can we I just, be honest though that the scrambled eggs is probably the easiest egg to make? No, it's not not <laughs> good, not good, not good, not good. Good scrambled eggs are tough. Yeah. Okay. I just what do, you have need? do I can I get some salt? You do whatever you need to do. You get whatever you need to get. So cheese? this is interesting because Bert actually, you know, at the end of the day, they're joking. You gotta see through these bits. You gotta know these guys to see through this nonsense. Bert actually don't like Jeremiah cooking in his kitchen. He don't want to be showed up. So he's got it out for Jeremiah at the very beginning. He wants he, people to think that he's the only he is the best guy cook. that can do this kind of stuff. And everybody kind of hates Jeremiah. I didn't even think. I thought Bert would like him. So Bert's going to be very critical of his eggs. And Jeremiah finds himself in a dark spot. Let's see what happens. I just what do you have mean? Do I, can I get some salt? You do whatever you need to do. You get whatever you need to get. Do you have any cheese? I got. I, yep. I hope so. Okay. Wow. Do we have cheese in here? This gets awkward. Oh, uh, they're better with cheese. Oh, so yeah, you don't need them. I've had them with that. Okay. Okay. Right. Too, too many cooks in the kitchen. Uh, uh, no. You know what? I'm just gonna do salt and butter and see okay. what you think. I'm, I'm ready for this. I'm ready. By the way, he just puts fucking. Four tablespoons of butter, and he's like, "They're pretty oh, good." Right. Like, everything and then they have some in it. This is uh, Bert. This isn't a good luck here. Look at Bert. Jealousy. Sashaying around, like, "Oh yeah, I bet these eggs are gonna be." What kind of Bert is this? I thought Bert was a family man, a friendly man. Someone in the chat is like, "I dislike everything about Jerry," and I was like, "Who Jerry, is yeah. that?" Jerry, I was like, "Oh, Jeremiah." Jeremiah, yeah. We're Jerry. really digging into him. People really haven't had the uh, patience or the care to investigate him only me and i have found a lot of secrets four tablespoons of butter and he's like they're pretty good and right. like everything and better with butter. In it salty as fuck he's like and i put some msg in it not bad by the way it's great that you guys so, have a power outlet bert right? wants those eggs to fail and he's gonna make sure uh that they do fail watch this right here so i can just play with it like all you know, i'm like i almost like electrocuted yeah, myself like. <laughs> oh. tony hey i did yeah, need a time fork. to catch up buddy come on buddy yeah, what are you doing here? Well, I got a. Oh. You got Brian. Mm -hmm. They're drinking. Oh, do you have a fork or a spatula? Now, uh, some, some kind of tool? Yeah, yeah, right over here. Right, it's in the, on there. Keep on your there. eye on nervous Jeremiah. You got a fork or a spatula? So let's see. Jeremiah Bragg and he can make those best eggs. Let's see what happens. Spatula City. So, um. Is that this is the key to know if you're friends with, uh, with this man. Is if you call him Brian or you call him Red Band? Yeah, I hate when people call me Red Band. Really? Ooh. Yeah. Really? That's a great nickname. Good to know. <laughs> uh, years and years. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, Jeremiah. Keep why your eye on like Jeremiah. Like Don't get distracted. But isn't that the fake name that you came up with? So yeah, look at Jeremiah. He's already uh, choking under the pressure. He's got a big stick of butter. You could see Bert is eyeing him. No, look at Bert directly looking yeah. at his butter. And he's got a rubber spatula, you know, one that you would use to scrape the brownie gook off the inside of the bowl. And he's trying to cut frozen hard butter into the pan with it. And he keeps slipping. So he's going like, he's got this thing of butter and he's got the spatula and he's going, uh, but it's not, keeps slipping. And Bert 
caught wind of this. He goes, oh, God, he can't even get the butter right. You know, when yeah, I, it's like if someone called it was me a machine, a, yeah, was I'd a, be cool with it. It was just a screen name from like AOL. And then uh, then I had like a website and I would call it that also. Each keep Now cutting. Jeremiah's got this big knife out and he's going to be cutting the butter on the countertop with no cutting board. And look at Bert. He don't like this. Well, and then yeah. uh, then I had like a website and I would call it that also. Each keep cutting him fucking this up royally. Keep going. Yeah. Keep going. I'm watching you try to cut this butter. Oh, let's. Where was the? Okay, we're good. Yeah, right on the chicken. <sighs> Someone doesn't have a cardiologist. <laughs> and always on this show, somebody makes a comment about food contamination as if they fucking care. These Taco Bell queens, <laughs> these pigs of the 7-Eleven free 82-ounce Coke. All of a sudden, they care about uh, foodborne illness here. I mean, this guy, Brian Redband, eats at Bob's Big Boy at 6 in the morning. All right? And all of a sudden, always oh, cutting the butter right where the chicken was. They're always making a comment about stuff like that. Cross-contamination on the show. Wait until you see this chicken. So look at Jeremiah, and they're already starting to uh, razz him about his skills. Okay, we're good. Yeah, right on the chicken. Oh, someone doesn't have a cardiologist. <laughs> wow. What? Yeah. That's good. No, it's Actually, good. It's good. fun fact, Jeremiah has the uh, blood pressure of a runner. Yep. His doctor told him, his liar so of a So Jeremiah is now melting the butter in the nonstick skillet, and he's using one of those... Uh, they don't use the stove range burners. They use a uh, temporary burner, one of those electric burners. That they put. You see this Binging all the time. With babish style. Yeah, everybody uses these, and they're just uh, hot plates, but uh, it's the same shit. You're just making eggs. Very easy to make eggs on one of those. Uh, but he's using the knife to run the butter. He's got this big slicing knife, a knife that you would use for uh, slicing meat, carving turkey maybe. Maybe even, uh, yeah, it's a knife. And he's using the edge of the knife to melt the butter around the nonstick skillet. And Bert's got his eye on it. And everybody knows you don't put a big, sharp knife blade on the bottom of a nonstick skillet. With it. You're going to scratch that whole thing up. It's going to be unusable. So Bert's already going, I thought you were the best at making eggs. You're using this giant knife. You're scraping up my pans, my tea fowl. Doctor told him that uh, he has a runner's blood pressure. Uh, I have a runner's blood pressure <laughs> yeah, as well. Exactly. See? But I'm on a lot of medication. Uh -huh. Is this on high? No, no, no. It's on low. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, 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 put the knife oh, down. Oh. Now they're all kind of, oh, what is it on? What is the temperature on? This is like when Jules tries to cook and I come in there and start fidgeting with everything and changing it to my liking. It's Bert's horrible. basically treating him like I treat <laughs> you. All right, let's see. Put the knife down. Put the knife down, down. Okay. You wow. turned it up. Be careful over there. You are taking your fucking time. Yeah, that's wow. what is required to make amazing that's eggs. True. That's true. That's the secret. That's to the his secret eggs. to my eggs. And okay. I want everybody to know this before because I something's literally burning. Asked them. Yep. So they're really giving Jeremiah a hard time. You're taking your sweet time. How long does it take to melt some butter? Jeremiah's got his first egg in the ham. Let's see what he does. It's all about how much are you making? Oosh. You Ooh. said make a lot. Right. Oh. Our potatoes are ready. Cracking on the side of the pan, a real rookie move, a fool's move to crack that egg on the side of the pan. You're going to get shells everywhere. Everyone knows you crack on a flat surface, you open that egg, toss the eggshell behind your back for good luck. <laughs> you don't crack on the edge of a pan. That's amateur hour. He's got about six eggs in there, and boy, those yolks are yellow. Cheap. We are not in the UK. We are in Middle America. Here, are those in yolks. In LA, you can get some orange yolks. I want those yolks so orange and so Englishy looking. Ashley Butterfield knows what I'm talking about. You go to the UK, your yolk is a gold orange. It's off Don't you looking. You hate it? When, wait, what? I mean, it's off looking compared to our eggs. I, I think it's better. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I mean, the we're so way used better. to those shitty yellow watery when looking eggs. I go eggs. to a brunch place and cut open yeah. my poached egg and it spills out yellow instead of orange. I'm yeah. like, Ugh. Yikes. So these are some cheap Trader Joe's looking eggs. Jeremiah's put about seven of them in the pan. Let's see it's what happens. How much are you making? He said make a lot. All right. Oh. Our potatoes are ready. They're After all these, questioning we'll him. Six eggs. <laughs> Jeez. All right. I'm going to put these back for <laughs> Ryan. Yeah. And are you going to, how long do these, are these eggs going to be like... Like a pregnancy, is it going to take to term? 
No, no, it'll, well, I'm also, this is a hot plate. I usually yeah. use a stove, so okay. we'll, I'm trying to figure uh, out the heat with this. Right. 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 Very easy to work the heat. I mean, it takes somebody who could make the best eggs. You throw a frying pan on any heating element, whether it's a matchstick, <laughs> a open flame, or an electric range like this, you should see when the butter's foaming, you know how hot it is. It's very easy to tell, okay? By the way, my daughters, we went to Not a lot of excuses. excuses. And my daughters, I said, you guys should learn some catch. <laughs> Are you fucking... Totally oh, I like that. Game. I like that. Okay. Yeah, this Jeremiah's hair looks like that guy oh, from... Okay, so he already doesn't know how to make eggs. He's got the raw eggs in the pan, and he took a handful of kosher salt and salted the eggs before they're even starting to cook. Everybody knows that is a huge no-no. You're going to dry those eggs out. They're going to be awful. You want to season the eggs right before they're almost finished this is a cardinal rule pretty much across the board you never salt raw egg it's not done American so we don't know can i tell you he had <laughs> he had the worst long hair ever didn't he like his long hair never looked cool it just looked like oh that's long like he never had like the best like cool now long hair. making fun of his hair so he's starting to get a little exhausted now i want to remind people what the eggs look like uh, you've got the pan, and let me see if we could cut to this again. Can we see it? No, I'm going way too far back now. You cut to the pan, and it's a cold pan. The butter hasn't even foamed yet, and he's just cracked all the eggs, and they're basically sitting there. He's supposed to be making scrambled eggs, but he's letting all these eggs kind of harden into, you know, like an over-easy egg or a fried egg. He's got all these cracked eggs. He's not scrambling anything yet. I like that. Okay. Yeah, this Jeremiah's hair looks Look at like a guy from uh, America. So you can see some of the egg whites are starting to harden while the egg yolks are there. They're bright, almost neon uh, tennis ball yellow. <laughs> you don't want your eggs like that. And you're going, okay, so when he starts scrambling, it's going to be hard and you're going to get those white pieces in there, which I don't mind sometimes if I'm making trash eggs, you know, like uh, what's his name? Brad Pitt would make in his little trailer in Hollywood's. Like, Here. Can I tell you, he had <laughs> he had the worst long hair ever, didn't he? Like his long hair never looked cool. Making fun it of his hair? Like, okay. Oh, that's long. <laughs> like he never had like the best like cool right, long honestly, hair. Wait right till you see this. I disagree. I thought, I thought Jeremiah's long hair was awesome. He looked like the guy they picked up in Fear and Loathing Las Vegas that was hitchhiking. Uh -huh. Do you yeah, remember? They're all making fun of him. Remember, Jeremiah, I make the best eggs. Nobody asked him to do this. He looked, nope. like, he looked like he was... He brought this up. He volunteered. And Bert don't like this. Bert wants to stick to the plan. None of these hosts... Let me tell you something. As a host, we don't want any surprises, okay? Let us guide the way. You shut up. You sit there and shut the fuck up. In, oh, yeah. uh, in that Toby, 70s show. Toby Maguire was the guy in Pierre. Yeah, Lee. yeah. Okay, yeah. so yeah. now he's just shittily mixing these eggs. Now, these eggs have already kind of hardened into place there, okay? And now he's just, you know, mixing them like a fucking fool. What? And yeah. uh, they're not really combining. I'm not Bert. certain what you're doing with these eggs, but I do feel like because you're so white, they're going to be amazing. See, the trick is, is everybody that makes scrambled eggs is always in a rush, yep. right? They're yeah. sloppy. They're like, oh, I'm going to make eggs. I'm going to make, oh, it's one eggs. They just make they the make eggs them as in two fast or three as minutes. they can. Yeah. They you turn don't the heat that. all the no way No one up. makes them as well as an unemployed guy sitting in his house while his wife's at work just going like, oh, I got nothing to do but make wow, eggs today. Wow, really digging well, in at Jeremiah. Last into 1130 in the afternoon. Why? Exactly. Jeremiah can make 17 Instagram stories off of two <laughs> eggs <laughs> being cracked. Yeah. He just milks it. Don't worry, we still have another 30 minutes for this chicken to get done, so we got plenty of time right. for eggs. Oh. I wasn't going to drink it all tonight. I haven't been drinking it all this month. So Jeremiah's doing this slow, you know, because you're supposed to go slow, but he's doing it, like, way too slow, and it's not really working. He and keeps everyone... pausing for, like, a full 30 seconds yeah. to laugh at something, and Bert is looking at him like, hurry up, Bert, hurry don't up. want him. You're cutting into this whole show here. They're saying what? you can I, tell I Bert is pissed because he's not shrieking with laughter. Yeah, look chat. at this. That's We've nice. never seen Bert. It's funny how you see him. He would never treat Bill Burr or Dan Soder like this. They really, the truth comes out around this Jeremiah, so he must be really uh, annoying. Let's see what happens. I to see Brian. Because <laughs> Brian, Brian's like, Brian's the kind of drinker that you can get lost in. Yeah. You're a great drinker, too, to be dead honest with you. Yeah. Uh, favorite Tony Hinchcliffe story. Do you know what it is already? No, I can't wait uh -uh. to hear this. Favorite Tony Hinchcliffe story. The reason I will, there's a few people... I won't talk shit about behind their back. I'll talk shit, like, I always joke around about so everybody. We're watching the whole like, experience trash. 
Tony Hinchcliffe's definitely one of them. Judd Apatow's one of them. Judd Apatow gave me the best intro. Oh, it happened on the same night. Ignore all this shit. Tony, I had my first spot in the OR. You pulled me aside, and, you saw, oh. and not a lot of people knew Here's it. Here's Jeremiah doing a bit. See, the attention is uh, kind of faded. He thought, I'm making the eggs. I'm going to get all the attention. That didn't work. They've changed the topics. Here's Jeremiah. He's put ice into a shot glass, and now he's filling the shot glass with Coke, hoping that everyone sees and makes a big spectacle out of it, but nobody's watching. There's nothing worse than the autistic kid trying to do a bit that nobody is paying attention to. And by the way, they know he's doing it, and they're purposely not paying attention or <laughs> giving him credit. You've seen this. Classic. You've seen this at a party. Look at this child. He's a 40-year-old guy acting like a spazoid kid. thought I was already passed in the comedy store. Tony pulled me aside. He said, hey, man, congratulations. On Look, the no shot. one's looking. And I was oh. like, what? You're like, first spot in the Is old. there anything more pathetic than trying to do a bit? Nobody's watching. And then you, you're making a big thing. Nobody's still you watching. You bump into the table really yeah. hard to and get then their you attention gotta, to look then over. Then you got to just kind of give up <laughs> on the bit. Yikes. You'll never see Mikey in a situation like this. Or, man, congrats. Welcome to the store. It was like, you know, like, I mean, theoretically, I'm an older, I'm older than you are. I was, oh, I've been yeah. on TV a bunch. I'd, I'd had a career, but that meant so much to me that, like, because I didn't, I was really, Keep like, your eye on Jeremiah. So excited about it. It's a big deal. It's I think, a huge deal. I think it's even, I think it's even a bigger deal. So you can see by his, he don't know what he's doing. He's, like, flipping the goop now, and it's just so stupid. And Bert has... Gaze down at the pan once more. Getting it in the comedy store late like that. I mean, Jeremiah, these are cooking so slow. Yeah, you're making yeah, a silly. Look at Jeremiah. I mean, who would have guessed that you would have made a whole scene about I this? I hope here? these suck dick. Me too. Wow. Maybe. Why do you hope they suck dick? Now, Tony is actually getting personally invested in this because he vouched for his eggs. And now Tony needs to be outspoken about how shitty they are so that he doesn't get any of the blame. See, Tony's really wrapped up. In, sort of a William Montgomery style situation. Yeah. I'm not going to be, uh, you know, taking the blame for these bad eggs. So I'm going to make fun of Jeremiah now. And now everyone's making fun of Jeremiah and Jeremiah's going to make these eggs. Look at this. This gets worse. Who would have guessed that you would have made a whole scene about I this? I hope here? these suck dick. Me too. Maybe... Um, I'm not used to the temperature. I'm trying to figure it out. Oh, oh, we got our first excuse. I'm not used to the temperature. But done in a kid way. You notice that kid way? Now, you're going to notice Brian Redband joins in on the picking, which is weird. So there is some resentment against this Jeremiah. I bet Jeremiah is a big know-it-all, and they can't wait for him to fuck up. So they could go, you know what, Jeremiah? Humble yourself. Sit down. Me too. Maybe. Um, I'm not used to the temperature. I'm trying no, to figure yeah, it out. A lot of people make excuses. Yeah, Ashley like Butterfield says, ha ha, what a stupid scene that's occurring. <laughs> yep. Sometimes people need to slow down to see how stupid things could be. Um, I'm not used to the temperature. I'm trying to no, figure yeah, it out. A lot of people make excuses when they yeah. fail. Did you not yeah. put milk in there or no. something? No, no, no. And, and, Did this? you not put milk in there? What a weird thing to say about eggs. So Tony's trying to get in on the nitpicking, but he don't know nothing about nothing. So he goes, did you not even put milk in there? And Jeremiah goes, no. As if that's something these white trash people do. They're pouring milk into their eggs. They think it makes it fluffier. Gross. Milk in eggs is a 90s fucking move. No one is doing that anymore. Do you hear Tony? Excuses when they fail. Yeah. Did you not yeah. put milk in there? Or no, no, no. And, I, and I, I've never seen someone scramble hard-boiled eggs. Like these are these are like you've yeah. gotten the yellows so separate from the whites. I don't know how you did that. I can't wait to taste these. And that's eggs. the first time I heard of it. All oh, those yellows are separate from the whites, and they're being slowly mixed. Okay, you know what? I've actually enjoyed eggs like that. You know. Sometimes my dad would make a quick egg like that. He'd throw an egg in the pan and scramble it, and there'd be like white parts and yellow parts, and it kind of even looked pretty. I actually enjoyed it sometimes. I don't it like is not like proper that. like that. No, people hate it like that. It is, you don't say, I make the best eggs, and you make them like that. I actually hate every scrambled egg except yeah. for the one good Gordon Ramsay kind. Well, you know what? I, I, I brought that up because I do know some people do make it like that. They brought up 
make eggs like that, and they do enjoy them like that. But I do want to let you know, when you're saying they make the best eggs, they're not supposed to be separated exactly. like that, okay? Jeremiah. I mean, I don't know. This is <laughs> I see chicken chickens looking. hatch these quicker. <laughs> yeah, like a chicken hatch. <laughs> like a fun fact. Way, thanks for filling time while we waited for the fucking chicken to cook. Yeah. You got it, man. Looks like what came candy. first, the chicken or the egg? <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. 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 Nice again. Yeah. Ooh, Jeremiah's starting to get pissed, and they're all starting to go, oh, it's kind of fun to pick on Jeremiah, something to do. Yeah. Uh, how did you get black stuff in there? Uh, fresh ground black oh, pepper. Okay. Yeah. 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 This is weird. So they're picking on him. How did you get black stuff in there, they say? What the fuck? And it turns out it's just pepper. Pepper. What is so weird about- To be about fair, at the beginning, he said he was only going to use butter and salt. Yeah. So he might have been panicking so, about the flavor. Yes, and, and he did. Extra so things. what is this black stuff? He was panicking. He started putting in pepper. Did he put in <laughs> too much pepper? We're going to find out. But remember this. What is that black stuff, Bert asks? Yeah, black stuff in there. Uh, fresh ground black oh, pepper. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that, so, that someone says, I hope it's Teflon. Yeah, from the non-stick flaking off from that knife. <laughs> I bet you it is. Because why would you say, you wouldn't call pepper black stuff. You Everyone know knows pepper. pepper. We know what pepper looks like. So I bet there is black Teflon flakes. Stuff in there. Uh, fresh ground black oh, pepper. Okay. Uh, yeah. It, so, are are these really eggs, segregated. Are these eggs going to be hot when we taste them? Oh, yeah. Wow, Jesus. Bert. Uh, I'll get emergency food though if I'm in a hotel room for a couple days because you never know you come back and you're like everything's closed you, you you don't you know you have nothing to eat so I'll order extra chicken wings or something yeah okay, no it makes sense. I've been hey, I've been there as long as I'm not saying it's healthy yeah you know who else used to do that Ralphie by the way oh, yeah? emergency pizzas yeah. at one Ralphie's dead you, you should add uh, you should add Brian to your uh, fat guys podcast what do you call that with you and Tom wait till you see these guys yeah it should be uh, fat guys yeah yeah. Yeah, he's a Look little that cub. Melon. That's what you can convince him. Is the uh, small one. Wait, are you done with these eggs? Are they coming out? Pretty close. Are they ready? They're, they're, they're pretty, they're pretty close. close. They're pretty close. I mean, that looks like raw chicken eggs. No, they're they they look a little funky. I think they're gonna taste okay. Wow. I'm not. I'm, not, I'm just gonna let you know. I'm the one that endorsed these eggs. But they I'm, look a little funky. Look, you can see those strands. If I am ever making eggs and they make that egg flake, you ever seen that <laughs> where it's like an egg piece of paper? I throw the whole thing away and start over. You shouldn't have any egg paper in there. I'm not trying a bite of those. I'm definitely trying Wait, a bite you of need to Listen to Tony. Let you know, I'm the one that endorsed these eggs, but I'm not trying a bite of those. Wow. <laughs> so they look so shitty. Tony goes, I'm the one who endorsed these. I'm not trying a bite of those. So everyone's going, wow, they look shitty. Red Band's even making a face. This guy's the uh, Wendy's ensemble queen. We've seen what him and the grudge eat. So when Red Band is making a face at your eggs, uh-oh. Definitely trying to You need these. to try them because I'm they will taste to good. I'm but definitely trying like they're, they're, not, they're not as fluffy I like as I usually. flipping them in threes. I, I, yeah. I have scrambled eggs every single morning. That's what my girlfriend cooks oh, every single again, morning. She doesn't wake uh, up in the morning. This is a lie, but go ahead. Five o'clock, all right? Yeah. But yeah. Uh, she makes it every day. And uh, so I can't wait to taste them. She puts uh, onions, though, and uh, feta cheese in them oh, and mushrooms. This the, is the salt canned butter. mushrooms, the little small canned mushrooms. This is salt and butter. It's the best scramble right. ever. So I don't trying to doubt. This is salt and butter and a lot of pepper. pepper. What about the pepper? Watch this. Wait what down. you're doing, flipping these in three, <laughs> but is... I'm ready for these fucking eggs. Okay. Wow. Well, these are the most over easy right here. What? That's I don't normal. think you know what over easy means. Yeah. <laughs> they should really be rare. You mean medium? Roast? It's scrambled eggs. They should be all the same. He's going, these are the most over easy. This isn't a roast where the end part is yeah. well done and the middle yeah. is rare. And by the way, none of it's over easy. Bert's right. Look at this. He makes the best eggs. That's what he claimed. But I'm ready for these fucking eggs. Okay. Wow. Well, these are the most over easy right here. I don't yeah. think you know what over easy means. Yeah. <laughs> Those are and rare. You mean medium runny? rare? You mean Look at wet? the way that he's picking at them. I know it's he's going into that spazoid well, like autistic that's a little, thing. I used to do that picking at my food when I was ten. When yeah. you're moving it around the plate. Well, he's nervously. been he's all jacked up on <laughs> shots of coke. Shots of, and look at that pepper. Man, he's been using that uh, grinder there, doing a coarse grind into that egg. Here, let's see what happens. You mean sushi eggs? Yeah. <laughs> All Just right. put them all on the plate. Okay, Let's fine. Try okay, well, fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. But plate them. Remember, we're gonna have a beauty of this. Okay. okay. So it better look good. A beauty yeah. shot. So you put them on the side of what? Look at They're this. Green. You, them, you should have put them dead center. 
Yeah. They're Damn, all criticizing, and he's shaking. <laughs> he's shaking, so scared they're going to taste his eggs, and he's putting them on the side of the plate as if there's going to be sausage links and bacon and hash browns coming, and they're going, why aren't you putting it in the center, you fool? <laughs> so they're all picking on him. This is mob mentality against this Watkins. I'm on the side of what? You're putting, you should have put him dead center. Yeah. Mm. You have a drizzle somewhere that we don't know about? Yeah. Wow, even Red <laughs> Band picking on him? <laughs> Listen, this gets worse. They're all going. Wow, <laughs> look at that. that is wow. Who doesn't want a shot of whiskey and some scrambled yeah, eggs? You know, cool. Welcome, Welcome to America. All right. They're all mocking Here, hey, and watching. Rachel, you got another fork? Can we get a scrub scrub of this? Jeremiah is in pure panic mode. He is disassociated from his own body. He's watching himself from an outside <laughs> ego. He has left his body and he can't compute. We've all been there. He's there now. Here's the eggs. Panicking. People don't want to eat them. They're all mocking the eggs. Let's see. I think Brian Redband's going for those eggs. Someone. Look at Brian. Oh, Redband's Red trying. All right, here we go. All right. I love so Redband takes a bite of the egg. What do you guys think? Is he going to like them or is he going to hate Let's them? Let's do it. Press one if he likes yeah. them. Press two if he hates them. One if you think Redband is going to like the eggs and go, they're actually really good. Or two if he hates them what do you guys think now remember this is brian redban a guy who eats he gets excited when he finds that fry from last week that mcdonald's fry in the back seat of his te tesla on the ground they're still good mm, mm, mm. it's delicious have you ever tried these i mean this is a guy you know he'll take a mcdonald's chicken sandwich He'll, you know, scrape everything off of it. It's He'll combine it with Wendy's. It's between ones and twos in the chat right oh, now. Oh, wow. So, so people don't know what's going to happen here. All right, so let's see this again. Brian Redband is going to try those eggs. He'll eat it all. They call him the dirt devil. Let's you know? see if he likes these oh, eggs. Someone. Oh, Redband's trying. All right, here we go. All right, I I'll tell you what I like already. I like that they're runny. I love yeah. wet eggs. No. I love wet eggs. No. I no. love wet eggs. Okay, Red Man is going, no, no, no. <laughs> As Bert's saying that he loves wet eggs. Look at Jeremiah's little face over here. Bert's going to try the eggs now. Let's see what happens. Hey, mm. Oh, no, please. No. Red Man is going, no, <laughs> no. Okay, there's a lot happening. They're all trying the eggs. They're all smiling. Look at Tony. Now, here's something big. There's a lot going on at once. Jeremiah reaches in silently while they're all trying the eggs and takes the most generous scoop I've ever seen. Almost as if he wants those eggs gone so it looks like everyone ate them up. Watch. Keep your eye on Jeremiah. Keep your eye on Red Band. Keep your eye on Bert. I know there's a lot going on. We're going to figure this out. Look at Red Band's face. I like already. I like that they're runny. I love yeah. wet eggs. No. I love wet eggs. I no. love wet eggs. Okay, now watch mm, Jeremiah. No, no. The pepper. They're, they're peppered. No, they're not for it. What no, is... pepper. Oh, I, I mean, I'll eat it. it. I'll use it. Thank you. Look at Jeremiah's. Oh my God. It's bigger than I wrote. Jeremiah biggest literally ate life. an entire shirt. I mean, he took a serving spoon like your mom would use during Thanksgiving for the stuffing or something. And filled that with egg. Watch Jeremiah's spoonful just so we could delete the evidence to pretend that everyone ate up the eggs. This is insane. Watch no, Jeremiah. No, what no, is... Oh, I, I mean, I I'll eat it. it. I'll use it. Thank you. Holy fuck! Wait. You gotta pause. I have to pause on that bit. No, Wait till you see it. I've never seen oh, anything I, like I mean, it. I'll eat it. I'll use it. Thank you. That is more egg. Ah! Wait. Hold on. There's a better shot. No, Look at no, this. No, no, I gotta get it. Oh, I, I mean, I I'll eat it. it. I'll use it. Thank you. Look at oh. the amount of egg on there. That is huge. And he's gonna shove it all in his mouth and he keeps doing it. Because he wants this people to think the they're only great. Big they're bite. delicious! They're delicious! <laughs> and everyone's else is going, oh, they're awful. <laughs> I've never seen anyone do this. No, 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 not for it. No, is... Oh, I, I they're mean, horrible. I'll, I'll use it. Thank you. Look at that. These oh, are, these are runny. They're so yeah, runny. It has a consistency of like. They're a, pretty good. They're a little bit. Oh, <laughs> look at Jeremiah over there. Wait, you guys can't see his eyes. Look at this. Uh, these are runny. It, it has a consistency of like. They're a, pretty good. They're a little bit too peppery. I'm surprised they're, they're hot. They're too peppery. 
Now I can't even imagine. They were not I've supposed never to have this in the prop. first place. First of all, you know, he put about a dozen eggs in that pan. <laughs> How much pepper could he have put where they're too peppery? I know, like eggs can take a lot of pepper. I yeah, think, right? like eggs can take a lot of pepper. And I didn't see a lot of cracking going on. I mean, you got to crack. Sometimes you're over that pepper gun. You're going, come on, you know, I'm going to short myself on pepper. I don't want to be cracking all day. So you're going, but you did see Bert say there's a lot of black stuff in there. What if these are peppered eggs? <laughs> I like, you know, because I put a lot of pepper on stuff. I've never had too much pepper. He over peppered the eggs. These must be bad if people are <laughs> spitting them out due to pepper. So let's see what happens here. It has a consistency of like a- They're pretty good. They're a little bit too peppery. Oh, I'm surprised they're, they're hot. They're very hot. I didn't know I didn't expect them to be hot. I thought they'd be cold. But Look like at Red Man. Red Man's overreacting. These no, no, pretty the good. There's a little I, bit too I, much I got pepper. a lot of pepper. There's a little bit too much pepper. Wow, <laughs> Red Man can barely breathe. <laughs> And this is a guy who's just on hot ones. He needs to get, he has to be rushed to the hospital. Red Band had an easier time when he did that hot ones thing with Sean where they ate all the hot sauce. Did he or, do that? Or he did a hot one. It, no, remember he did a hot ones with Sean, but it was like at a picnic outside oh. area. Remember that? Sean Evans? Chris oh, Evans. I didn't know that. Oh yeah. Red Band was on hot ones. Look it up. Um, He's, yeah, he's, the pepper is even worse than, you know, the uh, hot tamale death sauce <laughs> that he had, the Scoville. So uh, they're all making fun. And look at Jeremiah. Look at him over there. Well, Red Van's staring. overreacting. He's very, he's staring In everyone that down. last pause, he was staring right at Red Van with pure Yeah, hate. and he's overwhelmed because everyone's trying his eggs and they all got a different comment and he can't field all the uh, criticism at once. So he's panicking. I didn't know I didn't expect them to be hot. I thought they'd be cold, but as long as you took cook them. It Red Man's overreacting. No, no, the pepper, There's a little I, bit too I much pepper. I got a lot of pepper. There's a little bit too much pepper. <laughs> and it, it, the consistency was very uh, jello. Wow. Like it, it didn't seem right. I like that. I don't, I don't oh my God, another giant mouthful of eggs by Jeremiah Wonders using a serving spoon. I can't even fit one of those in my mouth. That's no. like deep throating. You break your teeth. Do you see this mouthful? So he is trying to eat all those eggs before anyone even catches on. Doesn't make any sense. This is total autism. Since it was Look very uh, jello. Yeah, like it, it didn't Here it comes. seem right. I like that I don't know. Oh my God. Why? Another giant hidden sneaky serving of eggs that's about three eggs per spoonful three full eggs in his mouth look at this i don't hate it i don't I hate, hate it. it i, I want it to hate it, it. it it's like but... there's a there's a coating on my tongue still yeah like wow a, yeah. Like they're not slime. as good as my eggs I'm, I'm gonna let you know right now wow yeah those aren't my the eggs, eggs are that he's phenomenal. the eggs that he's made me before hey. i think he got a little he was feeling the heat he gets a little weird in front of the cameras and stuff he's you know he's yeah, no 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 i had a hot plate i had butter and i had salt and pepper i think it did pretty good that's all you uh, need. No, no one agrees. <laughs> I think I did pretty good. You made eggs, everyone's spitting them out and saying too peppery. <laughs> everyone's disgusted with they them. They have the consistency of jello. Pretty good compared saying. to what? A prison? <laughs> Look at everyone. So uh, let's see that again. He gets a little weird in front of the cameras and stuff. He's, you know, he's yeah, no, no, no. I had a hot plate, I had butter, and I had salt and pepper. I think it did pretty good. Uh, not bad, not bad. I'm not gonna. I'm one not out of ten. I'll give it a six. Hey, I give it a six, six out of ten for eggs, and that's from Red Band, a guy who eats ketchup packets as a gourmet meal. Let's see this. Uh, not bad, not bad. I'm not gonna. I'm one not out of ten. I'll give it a six. Hey, all right. Are there any good eggs. enough for me to finish? We're roasting huh? chicken. Mm -hmm. All the talk this week. Look I tried. It. I want to know if you did. Have you tried this new Popeye's spicy chicken sandwich? Oh. oh! <laughs> 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 wow. By the way, I have to tell you, Rachel is the heart of this show. Okay, they're I've talking tried about it in this company to be my personal assistant. This is great. I've tried. I'm coming up. Is there something else coming up? Um, do they get back maybe, to the eggs? You could. I can't remember if that was. There's the more end. stuff here. Let's just give it a play. And whatever they're paying her, I double it. I told her to give me a price. She is that imperative to this show. I could not make this show without her. I'm being wow. desperate. Okay, who cares? Wow. Shut up. It's great. an intern. Now, She's replaceable. I need, Rachel. Jesus Christ. <laughs> fucking, this girl's always dropping the fucking ball. Fun fact, she makes all the butter that's used on this show. She has a spinoff show called Something's Churning. Uh, Okie dokie. Uh, Ooh, that was a rare bomb by Tony. Not rare as in he doesn't bomb, but a, 
a really bad bomb. <laughs> Let's go to 50-50. Brian Redman masturbating. Oh, this is an extra. So we saw Jeremiah Eggs. How good was that, Amazing. huh? Amazing. What an epic content. fail. Online. An egg pick fail. <laughs> Let's harass him about eggs online every time. Oh, you make the worst eggs. I egg. wish every show involved people having to cook something yes, that they've been I love this. About. There's something about a comedian being braggadocious and cooking so shittily that I just love. Uh, bother him about eggs on social media for, I don't know, four months. What do you guys say? Anytime you come across a Jeremiah tweet, follow him on all platforms. Just write eggs, your eggs. Your eggs were insane. We saw you downing those eggs by the serving spoonful. You were trying to hide the eggs. Your eggs were peppery. People couldn't breathe from your eggs. They were drinking milk to get the pepper out of their mouth, even though it was just ground black pepper. All right, so let's go to 50-50. We're changing topics. Brian Redband is going to actually reveal something really chilling. And every once in a while, he does this. He's going to talk about how he used to masturbate when he was a kid. These are not jokes. Listen to this one. And everyone knows, Brian, you're letting too much slip. This is nuts. <laughs> and he's done this about his shitting stories. We've seen him do this before. So let's go to 5050, which is one of Josh Denny's favorite restaurants. I'm not even kidding. Slater's 5050 in Burbank. Never heard of it's it. It's a 50% beef burger, 50% ground bacon. I don't like that. I had enough with the... You don't need... You don't want it so much bacon. People think, the more bacon, the better. Enough with the bacon. I mean, if you want bacon, make 50, something with 50. bacon, not a he burger. He says it's the best burger. 50%. They just like that it's different, these people. I know. They Simple. think that's so good, Simple and it doesn't lines. make it better. Uh, and he claims 50-50. Slater's 50-50. I hate that place. So let's see. Uh, Brian Redband, he's going to talk about something really perverse this could be a rape let's hear this spicy mustard spicy brown dude i can't you can't make a mustard hot enough for me that's a fucking challenge i'm looking for a fucking oh. mustard sponsorship whoa get me your hottest fucking mustard i'll make a dish around it you be careful. i want fucking mustard i love I'll mustard. Spicy mustard i'm hoping to get lined up with mustard and make some sort of mustard like nine mustard dishes and we all sample all of them and just videos of us going it's just oh please let me go oh. I look at Jeremiah still thinking about his failed eggs and he's overeating Bert's chicken now to be like, hey, we all make good food, don't we? This Jeremiah should be locked up in a loony bin. Mustard gas. Oh. <laughs> it's a bomb mustard. Oh, wait, I just got that. Mustard gas probably burned the way mustard did. Shot up. Yeah. 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 I it's here it comes. Like, how did I not fucking know that my what whole time fucking life? At? I thought I was at the right time. 50 50? No, you're at 55 30. First of all, you skipped another Jeremiah time code oh, for I did? no reason. Oh, then okay. You went well, five tell me where I'm at here. Uh, just tell me. Okay. 48. 48 minutes okay. is not a big one. I can't but... see. You know, I don't know what people don't understand <laughs> about me. I'm like on. Mr. Magoo over here. I can't <laughs> see a like, damn thing. I don't even know doing? what we're watching. I'm guessing. Okay. I'm an audio guy. I could only hear sound and At color. 48 minutes, which is about 20 minutes after the egg situation, okay. he yeah. brings up the hot plate again, telling that he's been thinking about it this oh, whole time. Oh, okay. That's Here all we this are. is. So let's see. This is a quick one, and it's a uh, Jeremiah excuse, and then we'll get to this Brian Redband rape that I wasn't at. Yeah. I thought I was right there. I mean, it says 50-50, right? I was yeah, at like 50-40. Really? you just paused. To me, that looked like a zero in my mind That's here. That's scary. Well, look how small that number is. I mean, come on. That's about, uh, you know, the size of a digit on a dollar bill showing me the authenticity code or whatever that is. <laughs> the code. Why can't all dollars just have the same number on it? It's all the same. All right, here we are. Listen to this. Oh, this is not hot Just enough. pretend like it's a real feminist. <laughs> Get out of here, lady. I'd like to hear what you have to say. <laughs> I've had so many, I've had podcasts where I have like legit feminists that light me up on my podcast. Ah. And, and I, I'm, I, you know I'm not confrontational at all, so I just listen and then I get the worst hate mail. Done being your fan, Bert. You should stand up to that woman. I was like, what is that? I didn't bring her in here to fight. She wanted to fight. I just wanted to listen. Okay. These are not turning out the way I wanted Lo to. They're not hot enough. Oh, so the hot plate is not producing like you thought it would. <gasps> oh. Whoa! Wow, that face was worth it all. <laughs> 
So now Bert's food isn't heating up good and he's making excuses. And Jeremiah took that as an opportunity to gloat. Oh, it wasn't Jeremiah's fault. It's the hot plate. And, and look at Ashley Butterfield just sent that he's still tweeting about his eggs. Oh, so no. He's really so he's hung sensitive. up. Let's look at the tweet. <laughs> I didn't see this. Craig says, Jeremiah, your eggs looked great. And Jeremiah retweets that and writes, hear that, Bert Kreischer? Guys, I want this guy buried in those fucking yolks for the next eh, four to seven months. Egg, 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 egg. Oh, so the hot plate is not producing like you thought it would. <gasps> oh. Ooh, that is the face of a man who's in panic. That is not a confident face. That is a face of a poser trying to work through his emotions. All right, 50, okay, 50, 50. 50. 50 50. That's Remember? 55. Oh, wow. Yeah, you're right. Slater's 50 50. That's what I was talking about. Here we are. Brian Redband is going to tell a story that could be like that Brad Williams rape thing, I think. Let's hear. Let it rest. Yeah. Hey, just build uh, Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah. They're doing a cheers. The worst of your past be the worst of your future. Heck yeah. Look at this. Jeremiah, awesome. they're all drinking. Jeremiah's toasting with another shot of Coke. He doesn't drink. Alcohol makes him do screwy things to his sisters. You lost that love and feeling. All right, listen to this. You're about my age. Do you remember back in the day, like, I, I, when dinosaurs have, we, existed? When dinosaurs existed, but we didn't have internet. Ooh, so gotcha, gotcha. Ooh, gotcha. We didn't have internet. Bert, you're about my age. Do you remember back before internet existed? Okay. There's an internet, so what I would do is I would take a camera, like, like a film camera, and when we were at Disney uh, World, we would like I would take photos of girls in like bikinis and stuff, and then take get them printed, and then take my binoculars backwards. Why? If you take binoculars backwards and look at a photo, you could zoom in on the girl's boobs. That's how I used to masturbate. Oh my God! Jesus! <laughs> wow! He used to take a film photo and then turn his binoculars around and zoom in on the film, and then masturbate to the image. <laughs> On the blown up image of the girl? Listen to this. This is really crazy. That's stalking. And then take, get them printed, and then take my binoculars backwards. And if you take binoculars backwards and look at a photo, you could zoom in on the girl's boobs. That's how I used to masturbate. The girls? Oh how God. old were they? Yeah, that's listen. real though. Try I, it out. I just lost No, no, I'm your age. I used to take two rocks and crack my dick together. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> We have six potatoes. Was that it for that? Six potatoes. Jules? It's yeah. been. Okay. Wait, that so Jeremiah not having a good time. That was a creepy story from Brian. And now what do we got? 5130. Oh, nasty. this is just their nasty oh. chicken is revealed. 5130 is coming up right yeah. now. So watch this. Bert made chicken. So this whole time Bert's been making chicken. It's blood red. There's blood all over the chicken. And he's going <laughs> to serve this raw chicken to everyone. Look at this. That blood in the middle? Yeah, what is that? No, it's just don't even look at it. Wait, what? Don't, Dude, I wouldn't worry about it totally. Look at that chicken. It's blood red. Can you see the blood <laughs> all over? And they're going, is there blood on it? He goes, don't worry about it. It's fine. So they got to eat this undercooked chicken. You can tell. It looks like it's been cooked for, you know, 14 minutes on low. Look at this. They're all concerned. He's going to make them eat it. Six potatoes. It's been... Wait, is that blood in the middle? Yeah, what is that? No, what is it's that? just don't even look at it. Wait, what? Don't, Dude. I wouldn't worry about it, Tony. The old don't look at it. Yeah, yeah, a blood. Are you <laughs> cutting <laughs> <off? laughs> the blood? It's bone with blood in it. It's uh, fine. Uh, Jesus, you guys are such yeah. pussies. Yeah. You know? It's bone with blood in it. It's fine. You're such put. Imagine eating bloody chicken, and they're going to do it. They're all going to get foodborne illness. A lot of Asians are born with blue butts. Okay. Fact. It's called the Mongolian spy. Look it up. It's real. And that's one to grow on. Okay. And now he's going to cut the chicken up with scissors. I think that's it for this one. Pretty much. Something's burning. They've given us another one. I like it, man. I like watching these guys cut. Same. And then they're going to eat the blood chicken. Hopefully this kills off this whole Kill Tony. They're not able to do their show anymore because they're all in the hospital with E. coli bleeding from the eyes. Only Red Band will survive.